Hey, Cancer. So for you guys, I was getting like very specific messages. One, I feel someone is being very defensive about a situation. You may ask what this is about. Or you may have suspicions about something and like it's almost like they almost blame you. I don't know. I was getting a very much so a sense of that strong signs I was getting are Pisces and Capricorn. Also, I was getting that somebody's going to find out that they're pregnant. Like I feel like or maybe that has already happened for you so if it's not you it could be somebody close to you also i was getting a huge opportunity or it almost seems like a lump sum of money but i also do feel it could come in the form of like sales or something like that like i feel like you're gonna get like a rush of i guess good fortune when it comes to your finances so that's always really good but before i get started i would love to give a big thank you to everyone who has joined my patreon and to everyone who has checked out my lashes at jayslashes.com i really really appreciate you guys supporting me on my lash business i always get compliments about my eyelashes and makeup in general also i want to give a thank you to everyone who has went and subscribed to my second channel i do love the tarot of course but i do a lot of other shit over there as well so we do have the eight of wands coming right out. So some of you guys will be dealing with the fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag. And I'm kind of getting you're going to um, be getting some news or some communication um, from someone here. And I do feel like this is good news. We have the ace of swords energy. So I definitely like when I think of the ace of swords for one, it's clarity. I do feel like you could be getting um, a notification letting you know that I feel like something's going to go through or... Um, something has gone through or you've gone accepted or something like that. I really feel that there's, this is good news coming your way. Um, I do also feel it could be news regarding your business. If you have applied for um, anything like a business loan or something like that, I do feel like that is going to come through for you. Now, we do have the King of Wands energy coming out here. So for some reason, I mean, of course, some of you guys could be dealing with a fire sign, but I'm kind of getting that. Um, this could be your energy. I do feel like you're very ready to take action towards something. And I definitely feel it has to do... Um, with your finances or business, something like that. I'm also feeling that a lot of you are not allowing anything to get in your way at this time. We do have the Queen of Swords energy here. So some of you guys may have recently cut someone off. We do have the Six of Cups here at the bottom of the deck. So I do feel there could be somebody from your past um, that maybe you have cut out of your life. Or it could be somebody that you already have cut out of your life wanting to come back into your life. It could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Why is the Six of Cups energy here? Hello. Two of Cups flipping itself. Oh, I don't know if you can see that. But anyway, uh, yeah, Two of Cups. Somebody wants to reconnect with you um, in a romantic way. What is the energy surrounding Cancer? Oh, okay. So we have the Three of Swords and Justice in the reverse. Okay, so I will tell you this. The Three of Swords here and this person wanting to come back. I do feel like they... They want to apologize for something or maybe they want an apology from you. But do know, I'm feeling with justice in the reverse. I'm kind of feeling that they're not being truthful um, about this or they're not. For some reason I'm getting, you're not getting the full story about something. And it could have to do with someone from your past or someone that you're dealing with currently. But somebody is not giving you the full story here about something. Why is justice in the reverse? It's almost like... Someone's coming half clean about something. Or this person wants to come back into your life and they're not telling you everything that's going on in their lives. Give me more with the justice and the reverse. We do have the four of wands here. Okay, six. Oh, all right. So maybe somebody's lying about leaving a marriage or leaving a relationship. Maybe that is not completely over. Do they, like, them and this person do still have ties together? So I almost want to tell you for like, maybe this is only for a couple of you, but if there is somebody that does try to come back into your life and they're like, oh yeah, I'm single now or whatever, don't believe them. Because for some reason I feel that they're not completely telling you the truth about something. Universe, what is the energy surrounding cancer? What is the energy surrounding cancer? Okay, so you have the five of cups. This is regret, yeah. I'm definitely feeling somebody regrets a situation with you or something that they did or said to you. Could be an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We do have the King of Pentacles coming out, but yeah, I really feel that somebody. When I see, when I think of judgment, it makes me feel like like a judgment call. I definitely feel that somebody feels as if they've made a very wrong decision when it comes to you. 
And this could be why this person wants to reconcile and come back into your life. We do have the Three of Cups here. And I have to mention, we do have the Three of Cups and the Three of Swords. Of course, I, I mean, I know most readers use the Three of Cups as the third party card. I don't. I personally use the Three of Swords. So I definitely feel someone regrets cheating. I'll just say it. Um, if you were like aware of it or maybe this is something that happened in the past, this person does regret cheating on you. Oh, okay. So we have the Five of Wands and the Page of Swords. Ooh. Okay, so I am getting this this message. It might be reaching, but it popped in my head, so I have to say it. Um, I do feel as well, if somebody is coming back from the past and come back into your life, they may have a child that they are not mentioning, or maybe they have someone pregnant that they are not mentioning. So, yeah, do be aware of that as well. And the rest of what is the energy surrounding Cancer? Some of you guys may be dealing with a Leo. Getting Aquarius as well. Yeah, a strength card coming out. Yeah, I feel somebody's been like, be, I don't know, I feel like somebody's been waiting to speak to you. Or been waiting or wanting for a very long time to, like, for you two to reunite. Uh, we do have the Ace of Pentacles coming out here as well. So regardless of all this shit, um, I do feel as far as work and finances, I do see things lifting up for you guys. I definitely do feel something that you're pursuing. I was getting that with the Ace of Swords here as well. Um, something that you're pursuing or doing or starting, if you have considered starting something, a business, side hustle, whatever it is, I see this being very, very successful for you. Bringing in a lot of abundance. I do feel it's going to be... Um, pretty much your ticket to uh, like manifesting and getting what you want. I definitely feel like Ace of Pentacles energy, this is like a lot of money. This is like true stability. So I definitely do feel you guys are headed in that direction. Now, for some of you, I definitely am getting that you may be holding back from making this decision. Maybe you're not sure if you if it's a good idea to invest your time or your money at this time, but I am getting that absolutely now is the right time we do have the star card here in the world so i do feel now is the right time to get into whatever it is that you have been thinking about reverse what are the messages for cancer okay so we do have the hermit card energy so i'm getting for some of you that if right now your love life just does not seem to be going right like maybe you're not sure maybe you've been dealing with like people with bad intentions whatever it is maybe the past just keeps coming back and you're just not interested um i do feel now is the time for you to do you focus on you focus on your path focus on what you're doing especially with this king of wands energy here now is the time to take action towards this towards whatever it is that is going to bring you in the type of income that you want and of course this can be um, a new job opportunity coming in as well but it really does feel something like something creative that you're doing or that you are going to do. Universe, what are the messages? Okay. All right, so they just told me Gemini for some reason. Some of you guys, may that may be strong in your chart or maybe someone that you're dealing with. We do have the Page of Pentacles and the Nine of Swords. So I feel like some of you guys may be upset about a schooling situation. Maybe some of you guys um, are not liking what you're doing right now or even um, regretting maybe quitting a situation or something like that. I do feel that... For some reason, they're telling me you're going to get a second chance at doing something, at being successful. So do know, like, if you're kind of feeling just a little bit of guilt or just a little bit of anger, and I do feel like this is towards yourself for maybe not putting effort into something or for not doing something or going for something, do know that I feel like the universe is going to turn around and give you a second chance to do something or take an opportunity that is going to allow you to really achieve whatever these goals are that you have. So do be sure you take that opportunity or that you are focusing on yourself and what you want like the star card here this is your wishes this is your dreams also this does represent hope so i do feel you guys are absolutely on the right path i definitely feel like maybe if there was something in your life that happened maybe a you know shitty relationship or something like that that just has kind of slowed you down do know that things are going to start moving forward for you okay. But I'm definitely giving advice if that has happened to you. Advice is to not let this person back because all they're going to do is bring in drama and bullshit into your life. I'm also getting as well, if you are still in 
a kind of weird situation with someone. Maybe you're not sure if this relationship is going somewhere and maybe it hasn't been going somewhere for a very long time. The advice is to walk away and just do you at this time because I do feel the devil card flipping over here. This person's going to continue to kind of hold you back and not just not allow you to move forward with what you want. Now I am going to pull one of these oracle cards. These are just kind of like what to focus on. Universe, what are the messages for Cancer? Ooh, okay. So we do have purity and faith. Now, I really love that uh, the faith card came out because it's kind of what I was saying with this star card energy. There is hope in whatever you're feeling down about. Um, it definitely could be love life for some of you. Uh, for some, it also could be career and all of that, even though I do see your career turning and making a major turn major change for the better um do know that there is hope in the situation it is very important for you to keep the faith in whatever it is that you want your manifestations and your desires so i do hope that this reading was helpful for you you can order a personal reading if you would like at my website swordstarot.com and i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day mm -hmm.